A plasticine army of moths gathered outside Tate Modern yesterday in memory of one of Britain's favourite television presenters. Tony Hart died earlier this year, aged 83. Nearly 200 of the models drew an even larger crowd of onlookers on London's South Bank, fashioned by their creators as a way of saying thank you. I think he was a very inspirational man. Um, I think he was at the forefront of animation when we were kids. Um, I think it's just about getting people involved in art, isn't it? It's kind of what, what he did, a whole our generation, as it were, grew up watching art happening on TV, which is kind of really important. I think people, people doing stuff with their hands is really important and learning creativity is really important and that's kind of what this is all about. Um, it's absolutely amazing. We did, just didn't know how many people to expect, whether it be 50, whether it be 1,500. So at the moment, it's going pretty well. <laughs> The unusual event was organised on social networking website Facebook by a group of friends who wanted to pay tribute to the art enthusiast. You know what, Tony Hart was such a legend, let's do something in his honour, let's do it in his spirit. And so it was this whole idea of let's just do it, let's just make some morphs, bring them all down and um, we'll go from there and see what happens. <laughs> Over the course of his 50-year television career, Hart won two BAFTAs and a Lifetime Achievement Award. His infectious enthusiasm for DIY won him generation after generation of fans, clear from the many weird and wonderful versions of his plasticine companion, Morph.